Stuart Friesen had similar sentiments saying that they have made improvements all season long, that they now have the best foundation that they have found so far this season, and they can only go up from here. That's a great point on Stuart Friesen. 2025, and it will be on Fox. This is going to be That's cool. so much fun. Now watch you? this. How about that? Feel that that floor, the, the stadium floor, is about the top of the wall. That's how high it's going to be up so that they can have that baseball field in that Coliseum, in the great Coliseum in Bristol. MLB working with Bristol Motor Speedway. They came up with this concept. It's going to be awesome. Chase Elliott was out there. Of course, he's a Braves fan, so that'll be fun. Fun for him to root for his team. Meanwhile, back at Richmond Raceway here, Ty Majeski continues to lead over two and a half seconds. Christian Eck is behind him, Grant Enfinger. Let's get an update on the Gray Brothers, Josh. Well, after Nick Sanchez and Rajak Ruth picked up their first career wins earlier this season, Taylor Gray was the next young guy in line to get that win, but it's been a tough stretch as of the last six races. He finished outside the top ten in five of the last six races. He told me, we know the team has been struggling as of late. We've been working hard in the shop. We have been searching, but Richmond is a really good track for him. Finished inside the top ten in the trucks last year. Earlier this year in the Xfinity Series, a third place finish as well. So the team is very confident heading into tonight. He can lock up that playoff spot tonight. And right now, running in the fourth position, Amanda. Josh, we talked about the brake issue in qualifying that affected Tanner Gray and started it with a track position towards the rear of this grid. He has been up a couple of positions up until 23 right now, but I was talking to Tanner earlier today about sharing this journey with his brother, Taylor, who is currently in the playoffs and just how proud he was of Taylor for his growth in the Grass and Truck Series. But towards the end of the conversation, the grandfather, Johnny Gray, spoke up and he said, just make Amanda talked about Tanner Gray. He's back in 23rd. Let's listen in on the radio. This is all I got. I'm loose. I have no regret. I'm loose. I'm saying he's not having much fun right now. He's tired and wore out. He's sliding around. So you know, the fight concern is getting yeah. whacked. I mean, he's only a couple of trucks ahead of our leader. That Majeski's just ripping through the field. He needs a caution right now, really, within the next few laps. There's three trucks between he and Majeski that he has cushion as Majeski battles those trucks, but there's still 28 laps left in this stage, so that's he's going to get lapped if the caution doesn't fly. Yeah, that's Ty Dillon. He's chasing down the white truck on the outside. Just the second stage ends at lap 140, and then 110 laps final stage to get us to 250 total laps for the season. Yeah, all those drivers like Tanner Gray are really, really happy that Ty Majeski got blocked in there by the lap truck of Keith McGee. See Timmy Hill doing his best to stay in front of that night. You know, I think our strategy is pretty straightforward in these first two stages, Phil. You run to the brake and get your tires. And if you're at home watching, you think, oh, the rest of it would be simple too, right? Wrong. When we go into that third stage, these guys are going to flip the flip the script and try to do something different than the folks leading. If we get a green flag run in that third stage like we did last year, I was talking to Jeff Hensley today, and he said, you will gain 13 seconds by stopping mid per under green midway through that third stage. Outside turn three wall brings it down pit road. I've been watching Matt. He really had a pretty solid truck. Got by a lot of pretty good trucks. Got up and into the, you know, right around that 15th spot. Like the right front, yeah. Without it, either broke something or cut down a right front. I think you're exactly right. He broke. I think he had a flat right front. Yeah. Get him into the outside wall. Solid run here a year ago, too. Top five for Mills. So this is disappointing. 